Here's problem 27, 15. A conductor radius r length l and resistivity rho has resistance r. What is the new resistance if it is stretched to four times its original length? All right, so let's take a look at this conductor as it first appears. Let's say it has a resistance r naught and a length l naught and an area a naught. And we extrude it to four times its length. So we're going to go, let's use a red arrow here. We're going to go to a point where we're going to extrude this to four times its original length. So here's one section, two sections, three sections, four sections. So the new length, L, is going to equal four times the original length. However, we must have conservation of material. So as we extrude this to four times the length, the cross-sectional area is only going to be four times as one fourth as much. So our new cross-sectional area will be one fourth our old cross-sectional area um, over this cross-section right here. The reason being is that the volume must stay constant. So our new volume must equal the old volume and our new volume is the area times the length. The old volume is the original area times the original length. So the new area will equal the old area times the original length divided by the new length. New length is 4 L naught. So this is the old area L naught, 4 L naught. L naughts cancel out and we see that the new area is one-fourth the old area. So that's the way we can prove it mathematically. All right, so our new resistance is going to equal the resistivity times the new length, L, over the new area, A. And that is equal to the resistivity. The new length is four times the old length, 4 L naught. The new area is one-fourth the old area. So this is going to be um, 4 times 4, or 16, uh, times rho L naught over A naught. But rho L naught over A naught is the original resistance. So this is going to be 16 times our original resistance. So by extruding it, to four times the length, we have less area, which is going to increase the resistance because the uh, charges will have less area to go through and they'll be forced to go through a restricted path, which increases the resistance. And the new resistance, hence, is going to be 16 times the old resistance because we've extruded to a smaller, radi uh, smaller radius and a longer path.